Following Jesus Christ, we pray an Easter prayer. We pray, following Jesus, that we never allow the seeming power of a tomb in our life to imprison us. That we, with God, have the power to roll away the stone of any tomb that we have placed ourselves in or others have placed us in. That we have a roll away the stone power and we can rise again. We have a power to make a triumphant entry, as happened on Palm Sunday. We have the power to go through any crucifixion in life. And we, dear God, have all been crucified in some way. Wrongful things have been said about us. Uh, Others have said things like, I don't love you anymore. I don't want you to work for my company anymore. You're, you're fired. And when something like that happens, when someone says, I want a divorce, and that goes in and stings us, we feel as if we've been crucified. But God, we are not children of the first day of the terrible crucifixion that took place in our lives. We follow Jesus, and we realize that we rise again with your power coming through us, that no seeming event from the past will hold us down. And therefore, on this Easter, we agree in Jesus Christ's name not to keep dwelling on past pain, past crucifixions, past tomb experiences. We are rising up. We are standing up in our faith and becoming all that we can become. We want to walk. We want to have appearances after uh, the wonderful appearance that shows to everyone that we are a child of God, a person of faith, a person that walks the talk, that lives in their belief, a person that has gone beyond the event or the circumstance in their life, the pain, and has risen again to walk to the greatest victories yet in life. We pray Dear God, that you will lead us, and we agree to follow where you lead to wonderful pinnacles of success, wonderful pinnacles of happiness, wonderful mountaintop experiences of health and wholeness, wonderful love being in our lives by people that really sincerely care about us, and we give the same to them. Dear God, thank you for the life of Jesus Christ. Thank you for allowing Jesus to be my way shower. And I do see, God, I see the way. And I take it on as a Christian myself and wear it in my soul, my mind, my body. For not only myself to feel, but others to see as an example of one that follows you. In Jesus Christ's name, which means in Jesus Christ's nature, amen and amen.